What up YouTube, it's Chi Noble and I'm back with another video. And as you guys could tell by the title of the video, this is part two of my phone posit collection. And the reason why there is a part two to this collection is because this is my little posit pro collection video. And for the guys out here that don't know what a little posit pro is, it is a GS size phone posit. Now there are a lot of people that leave comments down below on my little posit pro sneakers thinking that these sneakers are fake. Well guys, they are not fake. They just do not make these sneakers look like the adult size coming in at number one and the order that I got these sneakers are Little Nike Foam Posit Vault. I haven't washed these off or anything in a very long time, so you probably can see like the dirt and dust on them, but these are AKA the Sharpie. This is the first foam posit that I ever picked up from myself. And uh, I really thought these joints were like the uh, adult foams, but they weren't. I quickly noticed that once they came in the mail. I bought these off a line from Foot Locker. And uh, I was like, why doesn't these look like the picture? Well, uh, bruh, that's when I noticed that these are <laughs> little posit pros. So this is my first foam posit ever, guys. The Vault Vault, aka Sharpies, coming in at number one. Coming in at number two on this list is the Nike Little Foam Posit Pro Spider Man. Yes, guys, these are the second Foam Posit Pros, or well, I should say Little Foam Posit Pros, that I picked up. Even though I got the first ones and the first ones look different I said hey shoot I like the way these look I gotta get this color as soon as it get back in stock when these joints got back in stock I was like okay gotta cop these so these was a must cop because these joints was fire to me uh, they still are fire I don't really wear them so much but coming in at number two is the Nike Little Foam Posit Pro Spider-Man. Coming in at number three is the Nike Little Posit One Lava Foams. Okay guys, these are the history foams for me guys. This is the first foam posit I ever debuted on my channel. Like, I got those other pair of phones, and I didn't make a channel at all. I used to watch uh, sneaker reviews and was like, dang, man, I really like those sneakers. But when I got these, I was like, you know what, I think I'm going to uh, do an unboxing. And that's how I made my first video with these sneakers, guys. Um, these joints were hella dope to me. When I opened up the box, I was like, yo, these joints is fire. These are one of my favorite pair of little foam posits. All right, so coming in at three is the lava foams. Coming in at number four is the Nike Foam Posit One Northern Lights. Yeah, yeah. For you guys that don't know about these sneakers out there, I mean, come on. I know you guys know about these phones. These were the All-Star Weekend joints that came out. <sighs> I don't know. I'm going to say about four years ago now, if I'm not mistaken, guys. These were dubbed off of the Northern Lights. Um, it's a place up in 
Canada, I can't explain it to you, the whole scientific thing of it or whatever, but there's northern lights and the lights are actually this color and a whole bunch of other like neon colorish, purplish, green that actually glows, guys. These joints came with these laces that are reflective and they came out with uh, some other laces as well, black with purple tips and green tips as well. These joints are fire. I thought, hey, after those lava phones and these came out, I was like, there's no questioning that uh, it's going to be some more hot releases. Um, to tell you guys the truth, I really want these in adults, but I could not get these joints in adults, so I settled for the GSI, so boom. Coming in at number four, the Northern Light Little Posit Ones. Coming in at Number five is the Nike Foam Posit Pro red leather joints. Now, guys, I really don't know if they had a nickname for these joints, but um, my nickname for these joints would definitely have been <laughs> Fuego. Okay, look at these joints. Man. Now, guys, I'm not going to front about these joints either. I definitely did want these in the adult size, but I definitely was like, oh, sure, I don't even care. Coming at number five is the red and black Nike Little Foam Posit Pro. Coming in at number six is the Nike Foam Posit Yeezys. I got these joints for $90 and an outlet so that was pretty dope um just on the humbug i went there and i found them and wifey picked them up for me these are the yeezys uh, i still will call them yeezys because these were the yeezy colors the color wave that yeezy came up with uh before he went to adidas so boom y'all coming in at number six is the Nike Little Pro Yeezys. The Nike Little Foam Posit Pro, basically people dub this to T1000 or the Silver Surfers. I think I will call it more of the Silver Surfers more than anything um, because I think that was like the real nickname for the shoe. The Nike Little Foam Posit 1 Gone Fishing Joints. Now, guys, these joints are way better in person and in the light because it has some type of like scale to it I had to get the camera to focus uh, maybe you guys can see it a little bit but there are print on here that is like a scaly look um, like a fish and I must say the yellow hasn't did that much yellowing only in some areas so that's pretty cool got the dead fish on the back got the gone fishing post right there but yeah um i actually really wanted these in the little posit ones because i thought it looked way better uh in this size so i actually really got this these sneakers and the GSI's because of the look to me was better. So, oh yeah, and uh, I brought the bag out just so you guys could see that these are official. And uh, I'm glad that they did give the GSI's uh, official bag that did come with it. So guys, coming in at number eight is the Nike Little Posit One Gone Fishing Foams. The Nike Little Foam Posit Pro Gold and Black. 
black joints. Yep. Now, I don't know the nickname of these joints either, but, um, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> these joints is dope. It came with the gold tip. Uh, the silver surfer joints came with silver tips. Um, I definitely had to grab these joints. These joints are fire. I did want the adult joints, so I did settle for these joints. But uh, as you guys can see, they still came out crispy and clean. The Nike Little Posit Pro Dark Heather Gray Joints. Now guys, I do not know the nickname to these joints, but I would definitely call these joints the Nike Tech Felice Joints. They have a different type of material and the feel on these joints are amazing. Let's see if it'll focus. Yeah. You guys can see that now. Yeah. These joints are jive dope. I just didn't understand why they came out in the summertime. Um, I think these came out last year. I, I don't really remember. Maybe even two years ago now. But um, coming in at number 10 is the... Tech fleece joints. The Nike Little Posit 1 Halloween joints. As you guys can see, uh, there are bats flying all over the sneakers, but at the same time, got a coffin with a wooden nail in it. If you guys can see it. Yeah. So, it's kind of like a Count Dracula type of vibe. So, maybe these joints really wouldn't be called the Batmans. I mean, you got the dog going Count Dracula castle in the back. So, let's just call these joints the Dracula joints. Coming in last, but definitely not least, the Nike Little Fun Posit Pro. Purple camel joints, or the bathing apes, or the little Wayne bathing apes, whatever you guys want to call them. Guys, this was my last uh, phone posit to be exact to uh, be copped. This is number 12, and my final Nike little phone posit pro. So this has been my little posit collection, part two of the phone posit madness that I have going on. To tell you guys the truth, the little posits are the most swaggiest to me when it comes to my whole phone posit collection, um, but the adult phone posits are the most comfortable -est. and I prefer wearing those more than I do prefer wearing these because these hurt my feet for some reason uh, it's a different feel it's a different shape but um, I like them both thanks for watching if you guys haven't checked out that last video of the part one of my phone posit collection please go back and uh, check out that video because that'll kind of get you up to date on why I have little phone posits Alright guys, see you next time.